ओके सो टुडे आई हैव दिस Asus H110M SCS motherboard its reversion is 1.02 so let's check first what problem this motherboard is facing so i have turned on this motherboard okay okay as you can see the fan is spinning okay so currently i have kept my multimeter in dc range 20 ओके लेट्स चेक वी कोर वोल्टेज विच इज अवेलेबल ओवर हियर सो दिस इज द इनपुट वोल्टेज 12 वोल्ट 12.31 पॉइंट थर्टी वन देन दिस इज द आउटपुट वोल्टेज एंड एज यू कैन सी वी डोंट हैव एनी काइंड ऑफ आउटपुट वोल्टेज इट मीन इन अवर मदर बोर्ड सी पी यू वी टी टी इज मिसिंग बिकॉज सी पी यू वी टी टी सिग्नल इज एनेबल फॉर दिस वी आर एम आई सी सो हियर we have a lm3 uh, 358 which generates the cpu vtt so i will show you something here we have a one mosfet pq307 at input we have a 5 volts on gate terminal we will check is there any kind of voltage no no voltage is available at gate terminal and on source terminal we will check no voltage right now we are going to make a jumper from this drain terminal of pq307 to source of pq307 so this is my jumper wire i will put little bit plus just remove removing ram Okay. I'm going to just jump for put the jumper over here. I think we have done successful jump this connection. So let me cross check once again. Okay. we have bypassed this now let's check whether our weak core voltage is generated or not so let me ground one probe just keep one probe on source terminal insert ram and start motherboard sorry okay okay i have started motherboard still we don't have any kind of weak core voltage okay so as you can see i have started model board and we have right now nearly 1.14 voltage so let's check for display so let me plug in my vga cable before that we were not having any kind of weak core voltage so okay okay turning on my power uh, motherboard okay motherboard is turned on 
it is restarted uh, restarted for one time and let's check for display okay so v core voltage is 1.14 volt is available and i think display is also available as you can see over here we have a display let me restart once again okay and powering on okay motherboard is powered on it fan spin and stop and again started spinning and let's check for display okay as you can see here we have asus logo once again we will see again i have started motherboard okay this is asus logo available over here okay so we have repaired this motherboard successfully as you can see and i am turning off this motherboard just removing all the connections and i will show where i have made that jumper so you can also repair if you get similar case so this is our asus h110 motherboard first of all we were not getting any kind of core voltage it means cpu vtt voltage was missing so here one second okay as you can see here there are two okay here there are two mosfets pq307 and pq305 on PQ307, I have connected this is the drain and this is source terminal. I have connected a wire, jumped a wire from drain to source, and now we have our CPU VTT and our VRM uh, core section is working fine, and we have display also. Thank you.